Okay, you lot, finally, after what feels like ages, by the way, since they, since they like announced that this was coming, the event is here. Um, woo. <laughs> Cuck. I can't wait. Uh, but yeah, uh, you know, if, if it's not for the experimental queue or any queue, bro, if you go friendly to user, and if you go free for all right now, there will be brothers playing for their lives in free for all because uh, if you didn't know how the event works, it's one of those where you win a game on a legend and you get a color for that legend. Uh, in this case, it's eSport V1. Other than that, there's like, these things that you, you shouldn't spend your money on. Uh, you know, you've got Peacock Artemis. It's kind of cool, I guess. Um, it's, yeah, it's just Sprahala, man, isn't it? Uh, well, actually, you know what? Colors. I would say Galas. Galas is an all-time color. Galas is a generational color. So you can spend your coins on that. I can't. You know, I've got 6,700 coins. I'm um, Brahala poor. Um, I'm in the Brahala gutters. I'm living on the, the streets of small Brohaven sucking sucking Teros, fucking milking off Teros for some bread these times. But do you get what I'm saying? Let's just get into this. I, I, I've already unlocked all the colors, so I can't even play in the fucking event then. You know, I've, otherwise, you know what I'm saying? I would go through, I'd complete a few, I'd play random or something. I can't. I already have them all, which is kind of a blessing because, bro, I remember last time <laughs> an event like this came out. It's for Esports V1. I think I already said that, but... Yeah, if you win a game right now in Brawl, in any matchmaking queue, you will get an Esports V1 code for the legend that you won on, right? So, you know, there we go. If you missed out on Esports V1, because like I said, they got taken entirely out of the rotation by BMG in favor of Esports V3. Uh, and I think Esports V2s are still around. I'm, I think so anyway. I'm not too sure. Either way, Esports V3 are vile. I don't know why they would... I mean, Esports V1 is low-key a bit disgusting too, but it, it works on a lot of skins. I've not seen a skin where Esports V3 works, so... Yeah, um, but you know, it, I, I'm, I'm assuming this is like the, the final chance, you know, uh, to, to get some some esports v ones if, if you did want them. So don't miss the event. I mean, I made a video saying don't miss the event like, I, I don't know, weeks ago because I thought that's when the event would be coming out. But like I said, bro, they, oh my goodness. Yeah, okay, let's just not talk about that. Then. Let's really and truly just look past it. Uh, but, you know, here we are. I guess they were waiting for the Battle Pass to finish first, which, oh my days, can I say? Wait, first of all, let me say, subscribe, or I'll do, I will enslave you. I will enslave you and doom you to an eternity of, of fucking doing Battle Pass mission. Bro, even this event is just more chores if you're thinking about it. Like, I, I enjoy the color events, and, you know, let me not, be, you know what I'm saying, be a hypocrite, because I've talked in the past that these events are the actual good kind of events. When you compare them to things like the just the bland, dry, fucking seasonal events that Rally do. Uh, like, these ones are actually good, right? But still, ultimately, you are just doing chores, you, you know? Uh, well, it depends. If you enjoy playing Rally, then it's not a chore, I guess. But if you don't subscribe, like I was going to say, I will, I will fucking do... I will, I will, I'll put you in the workshop, fam. And I will, I will, I will, I will force you. I will force you to, to complete people's battle pass fucking challenges, battle passes for the rest of your life. So definitely do that because, bro... So I was just going to say, last night, I had to ruin my fucking sleeping pattern again. I hadn't done it. And there was like, uh, bro, I don't even know how many hours left. When I looked at it, there was like nine hours left to the battle pass. And I thought, fuck. Obviously, I didn't get the completionist one. Uh, would I have considered it? No. I still had to spend mammoth coins to complete the battle pass as well. Because, yeah, man, it was just... But I tried to do as much as I could so that I would literally be saving money because I, I clocked. It's like I nearly just bought the whole thing and it would have been like 800 mammoth coins. And I was like, bro, that's actually like real life money that I've spent. Like, bro, I'm not doing. <laughs> I'm not by wasting my money on the battle pass and then wasting more money to get it done because they're so boring. I have to deal with. Yeah, I have never wanted to just fucking finish it all. Like I did last night, bro, grinding our battle pass challenges at 4 a.m. And you might think 4 a.m. You know, back in the day, if you were a true OG, I used to record videos at like 8 a.m., fam. Having not slept yet. But yeah, these days I go to sleep at like 1 a.m., fam. I'm, I'm adjusted. So yeah, um, went to sleep really late. So I woke up really late, which meant I had to record a video earlier. So basically what I did, right, was play Brahala for five hours straight yesterday. Which is not why I do... <laughs> regularly uh definitely not out of my own volition i would never do that anymore anyway uh and then i had to wake up and now i'm recording this video i'm playing more brawler and that's how my, that's how my days go <laughs> so uh yeah man you know pray for me uh and fuck you know uh, I, oh bro either i will just not buy the butter pass next season or i actually remember to do the challenges as they come because bro yeah that was that's a foul experience
and I do it to myself every fucking season. So I, I can't even complain anymore, bro. It's, it's my own fault, man. But um, other than that, I don't even know if I can talk about this, bro. I saw some some crazy stuff going on in the Brada community, bro. Some <laughs> like, bro. You know what? This is my channel. I really, truly, I don't give a fuck. I'll talk about whatever the fuck I want on my channel, fam. You know. I saw some some interesting shit going on with Wrenched, you know. Uh, Wrench, Wrench, definitely, I would say one of my favorite pros in terms of you know like gameplay, you know, Brahalo, um, of all time. Yeah, that brother's been getting been getting freaky. There's a uh, well, okay, uh, well, okay. Just to sum up the situation, and the 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 whole Twitter thread has been deleted now because you know I like I said I don't have Twitter anymore, so I was really late to it, so I never saw it live, but I've I've you know heard everything that went on and. Seen screenshots and stuff. Basically, this wrench brother is a father. And and do you get what I'm saying? Bro, but here's the thing though. All these Brahala plays, he's he's been clowned out of the community, yeah, because of people that just don't understand the situation, I think. And you know what I'm saying? Just cringe kids and shit. Just basically just taking the piss too hard. But at the same time, it's like as like a I don't know, like you expect it to happen. Do you know what I'm saying? You can't be too mad that people are taking the piss out of you. But that brother has fully deleted his, his Twitter account and everything, fam, because yeah. But Yeah, man. Um he just he got he got some some bitch pregnant. And he's he's and, and then she came out and you might think, oh well that's 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 fine, you know, that's what's what's crazy about that. I mean it's a little bit crazy, but it's not. You know what I'm saying? It's not too what the fuck is this guy doing? The fuck was I doing? I was just that okay, well anyway. Um but 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 she came out and she exposed him on Twitter. His, his baby mother. Who thought Brahala players would have baby mothers, fam? But do you get what I'm saying? You know, uh, fuck it, bro. E everything feels like a fever dream these days. Do you get what I'm saying? Anything can happen. Uh, and you know, proof proof is is this. Uh, and like I said, she came out on Twitter and exposed him for being a deadbeat father. He, he he she was talking about how he wanted to go BCX instead of like be there for his kid and everything, fam. And, you know, since since he knocked her up, he he's he's not been DMing her, he's been ghosting her for like eight months and Bro, yeah, this brother is bro, you can't go one fucking day in this blood plot community without some just drama that has no place <laughs> in the fucking community, fam. Like this is this yeah, I don't know. But that 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 most definitely was not on my fucking Brahla community, you know, 2023 bingo card. Yeah, that much. If it was, I'd be gas, bro. We're right at the end of the year. You know, that, that would be one I would never think would happen. And, you know, the brother came in clutch. Um, so, yeah. But like I said, bro, it's def it's one of those. Listen, and just from what I could gather from the situation, I'm not going to talk for him or whatever. It's one of those situations, man. It was an accident, you know? It's not like this brother intentionally, do you get what I'm saying, decided, fuck it, I'm going to have a child. You know, he just, he got freaky. And then you, you get what I'm saying? It was conceived. And you know, what can you do about it at that point? No, in America, you can't even can't even get it vacuumed out anymore, fam. Or maybe you can. I think in some states you can, but I don't know. Uh, yeah, so <laughs> in a long day. Uh, and do you get what I'm saying, bro? If you don't want the kid, you don't want the kid. You know, why would you be a fart? Bro, listen, I'm going to speak realness on the channel for a second, yeah? It's not his fault. <laughs> do you get what I'm saying? Who knows what the situation could have been? Maybe she was saying, you know, she's on she's on the pill. And it turns out she wasn't, you know, like I said, bro. I mean, most definitely, either way, it was an accident. Who knows if any, yeah, like, I'm not going to speak on a situation I know nothing about, but just all these people coming out and being like, oh, wrench a deadbeat father. Like, bro, he obviously doesn't want the fucking kid. You know what I'm saying? This is, free my man. Free my man from parenthood, fam. I, don't, <laughs> I wouldn't want the kid either, bro. <laughs> but it's crazy. I open, I, I see it, bro, and I'm seeing this picture of wrench just like holding, holding his, his baby mother's belly with the, with his, his, just sat next to this big girl. I mean, like big because she's pregnant. Well, no, I was gonna say big because she's pregnant, but she's big anyway. I mean, no offense, obviously, but like I said, I'm telling that how it is. You know, why would I? Yeah. So long day for for wrench. You know, hopefully you can recover from parenthood. Um, or you know, I. I be prepared for the, the child support payments. You know, that's why I have channel members. You know, I've got I'm paying all this child support every day. You know, that's why all the channel members fucking freeing me, freeing me from the shackles of pet. I'm joking. I don't have kids. Well, I do, but they're they're hairy. You know, like uh, like dogs hairy. Like I don't have Russian kids. You get what I'm saying? Um, you know, I've got a dog and a cat. 
But that's that's it for me, bro. I will not be having kids anytime fucking soon. I'll tell you that much. Uh, and if I did, it would be accident too. I mean, yeah, man. You know, Wrench, he's going to raise the next generation of Bradley players. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I don't know. I shouldn't be. I shouldn't be laughing about it because, like I said, bro, it's a, it's, it's a deep situation when you think about it. You know, you're getting exposed on on Rally Twitter. But what a way, though, bro. Why would you go and expose someone on Rally Twitter for being a deadbeat father? Like, bro, what is, what is the world come to, you, bro? You're getting women out here getting pregnant, and then, <laughs> and then obviously the brother doesn't want the kid, and, and then they come to Rally Twitter to expose him. And there's an ambulance coming past my yard. It's because Wrench is just throwing his fucking thing down the stairs. That's why. I can't say that. I can't say that. No, I can. I can. It's a joke, you know. Comedic, comedic purposes. Shouldn't take what I say seriously and all of that. But yeah, man. Um, that's yeah. Some, some, some more random ass, just absolutely out of fucking field Bradley drama. I thought I would want to tell you a lot about. Uh, and yeah, man. That's basically it for the video. If I'm honest, I, 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 I don't really have too much else to talk about. Like I said, just you know, in the queue your colors done um you no know i was saying yesterday actually about uh like well i was talking about beef versus chicken burgers and i was saying how yeah my mic decided to fuck up again at the end of that game so i don't know exactly what words i left off on bro i need to get a new mic you know it's pissing me off man you have no idea it's fucking pissing me off it's like you know when you record a whole entire fucking video and then you look back on the on the recording, oh, I'll just edit this and then, you know, go gym. No, no, no. Re-record the whole video because you, you listen to it, bro. And it, what are you listening to? Not words. Not, but what the fuck is this brother doing as well? Okay, anyway. um, What was I saying, bro? I don't know. Uh, Oh, yeah. Something about how, like, in yesterday's video, I was chatting about how, like, um, like, food, you go off so easily, right? Because you make it too often. And I was saying, like, how, how cooking is, you know, apologies for the deja vu if you did watch yesterday's video, but... To get everyone up to speed, you know. Uh, but how cooking is literally... What the fuck is he doing, fam? Okay. It's like 99% of the effort is actually going into finding recipes. Not... Did you get what I'm saying? Because there's like a balance to, to be had, you know. Between... Is the recipe affordable, right? Uh, you know, to, to, to eat, you know, quite often. Unless you only plan on eating it once, like that's okay. But then, have you really found a recipe if it's only like a one-time recipe? Like, you want a recipe you can make. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, all the time type thing. Um, uh, and like, you know, does it take too long to make? Does it, you know, it, it, there's a lot that goes into it. And you finally find a good recipe and then you rinse it. You eat it too much and it just ends up tasting like shit, bro. And you go off it for life. And then you have one less recipe. Even though you thought you found a perfect one. Yeah. Things like that, bro. I think there's there's, well, there's 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 two rules on the channel so far. There's rule number one, which is, of course, everyone should know. Uh, don't get gas. Rule number two, we, we came up with uh, for a bit of positivity um, a while back, which is stay hydrated, you know, trying to trying to help you lot out here a little bit. Um, and, and then rule number three, I think I will make, which is, and this is not, well, it's kind of related to what I was just saying. So I wanted to say it, but rule number three should be don't set your alarm to your favorite song. That's rule number three. Because it's the same concept, bro. It's like music that you really enjoy, bro. You find like your favorite song of all time. Do you get what I'm saying? But then you just rinse it and you say as your lot. Yeah, this guy is way too gassed. He broke the rule number one right there. Numerous times, multiple times over actually. But yeah, man. Don't. That, that, that's, that is the number one way to kill every single bit of love you have for that song. Bro. You will never want to hear it again. Because it's like people have a fucking... It's why, you honestly, you shouldn't even have like the... the deep Bro, these ambulances good today? Like, bro, dying brothers ruining my, ruining my fucking video. You know what I'm saying? Have some respect. Um, It's... Bro, you, you, why you shouldn't even have the default Apple, you know, alarm on in the first place? Because, bro, everyone has that. And then you see it everywhere. You see it in movies. You see it on TV. You see it on the internet all over the place, bro. It, you hear it, in, it when other people's alarms go off. You don't want to be hearing that. Because it's fucking, it, you have a physical reaction, fam. And this is this isn't even just me for, for, for once. Like I can confidently say in my chest, this is everybody. Everybody has a fucking physical reaction to hearing their alarm out in the in the wild, fam. Out in the open world, it's you, you, it's just not what you want to be hearing. So you need to go equip some of those like weirdo fucking, you get what I'm saying, alarms that nobody has ever used before. Uh, all the way down in that Apple settings. That's tech key right there, actually. Um. But yeah, 
other things that can just ruin your life of it. Balking. Praise the Lord, I'm done. I'm done balking. I know I'm not, you know, huge, but, you know, it's, uh, like I said, I'm, I'm kind of into rock climbing over everything. And not trying to be too heavy for that, or else, you know what I'm saying, I'm going to be ripping the holds off the wall on my way up, and, you know, it's going to be a little bit harder to be climbing upside down and shit if I weigh 200 kg. So, you know, uh, but, yeah, I'm, I'm at a weight I'm happy at, and thank God, bro, because I put on... I've said this before i put on 15 kg in like two months and it's like nothing will once again bro because you have to find a food that you can you can cook and eat like all the time when you're when you're bulking right you're trying to put some mass on yeah nothing will fuck it bro you will never eat that food again afterwards uh it's like you, you'll be eating gagging because you don't want to be eating anymore and then you have to continue eating gagging eating gagging until you're finally finished with the meal and it's just, bro, yeah. You know, who said the gym was supposed to be <laughs> healthy for you? I don't think that's very healthy, but, you know, when you're done with the book, you're done with the book. You know, you got to put some work in. You know, with the, you got to put the work in, in the in the kitchen as well. Or, or you don't really eat in the kitchen. But you know what I mean by that. Don't be a prick. Um, oh, my game lagging. I think my mic might have just cut out there, actually. Uh... Because, yeah, you know, for some reason, my game freezes when my mic cuts out. So, at least I have a warning. But maybe it didn't also. Why are brothers finally taking one stock of me today? Fighting for their lives, all three stocks. When that's, you know... I'm, I'm, I'm trying to keep decent players too, bro. And it's... I'm finding the diamond borders. Finally take one stock and then they're gassed. That should be standard. You should be taking these stocks off me with ease, bro. Like, you just don't be, don't be shit to the game. He's dead as well. Anyway, um... But yeah, I don't know. Too much of, of anything you enjoy, bro, is it's not. It's, it's don't, you don't want to be doing that. You just don't want to be fucking doing that, bro. I can never eat like um. I'm, I used to. I made this pasta every day. I made this 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 like pesto pasta. Oh oh, and tuna pasta. Oh bro, I was making tuna pasta. I can never eat it again, cause I will gag, bro. I will, cause that that's what I used to do. But I would eat it and just gag and oh. Fucking disgusting. I remember there was this one Kendrick Lamar song back in the day that they, like a really weird thing happened to me. I fell asleep. It was now or never, I think. It was in like the, the, the NBA 2K14 soundtrack, I think. And and I really liked that tune, right? Um, And I listened to it and there's another brother dying, bro. Now no, an ambulance going past my yard. Uh, but yeah, I listened to it overnight. Like I fell asleep to it and something so weird happened, man. The song changed, like, forever. Like, even to this day, like, the song sounds different. I don't know. I'm, I need to, like, do some do some research into what happened, bro. It's really weird, but... Yeah, I fell asleep to the song. I woke up, and the song never sounded the same. I think I might be, like, regarded or something. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but, yeah, you know, who, who fucking knows how that shit works? Anyway, let me think of a hint for you, Zemino. And we'll shout out the, the Ross Clark channel members. Okay, the hint will be Kylian Mbappe. Uh, and then let me shout out the channel members. Moro, Mike Brandenburg, Eris or Cage, and Wild Pokey, Sushi, Fish Sticks, Dude, Atomel, No Waffles, Ash Missing, Kenji, Jacob, Airquest, No Glory, Barky Builds, Fetchlor, Braskari, Deadly Jelly, Hegemony, X9, McD, Red Room, Lighter, Brandon Murray, Mike's Soul Podcast, Tequid RT, Earthman MC, Pinnacle, Ice, Wallow, Edit, Slush, Lacan, Atomic Wall, Lizio, Captain No, Hami, Awesome, Controller Mods, The Fat Melt, Andy Nocturne, Drunk Dog, Flashy, Colorful Alchemy, and King. Thank you all so much for the continued support, continued backings, continued. I run out of words actually, but you know, you don't know. I appreciate you a lot, man. Uh, and really and truly do help me out a lot. So from me to you, thank you. And I mean that. And everyone else, leave a like, subscribe. It's more than enough already. Uh, as for the hint, um, if any, and if you got any of the four, you, you know, you were correct. And until next time, I love you all. Have a great few days and peace.